Canals run dry, silent motorboats and gondolas at a standstill. For a few days, Venice, famed for its beautiful canals, has not been picture perfect. Really, the smell is terrible. It had more charm before. The strong sewage smell in some areas is doing nothing to help the city's gondoliers, who are already struggling on the low water levels. The exceptionally low tides are being blamed on multiple factors. Dry conditions, lack of rainfall, a full moon and an anti-cyclone dominating Western Europe's weather. Even with one person, it's a battle to get through. Even harder with these water levels. I hit the curb at every turn. For the locals, reliance on the water transport, it's a cause of real concern. I see it as a security problem. If someone needs an ambulance, it can't get there. I've never seen anything like it. On the Grand Canal, one of Venice's major water traffic corridors, the gondolas and Vaporetto water taxis are disrupted but still running to transport thousands across the city. The lack of water is widespread across the country, with Italian lakes and rivers extremely dry and the Alps with less than half of their normal snowfall. The latest weather forecasts, however, signal the arrival of much-needed precipitation and snowfall in the coming days.